Hello everybody, I'm Phoenix Ebola and welcome to... What is this called? Oh yeah, Technode Firmacraft Mod Pack. I was sort of hesitant to play a mod pack, but because I've completely reset my server, and I've already tested the frame rate on this thing, it's a bit slow, but Optifine is definitely helping. But yeah, so this is hopefully will be a new series that I can do. And yeah, if you guys don't know what this mod pack is, it's basically... One of the hardest mod packs I have played. Um, just sorry, just drinking up. <laughs> I'll get myself alive. Is and some of you will think, oh, you got like over a thousand health. That a thousand health does nothing. It's literally useless. I mean, it may look like it's a lot of health, but no, it isn't. So first of all, this mod pack is on the AT launcher. So and I've been playing this a few day, two days now in um, hardcore survival. And it is hard. I've already lost three three worlds trying to play this in hardcore. I've already died. So it's really difficult playing this mod pack. I, it's very easy to get yourself killed very early on. And in fact, for quite a while, you will be pretty much prone to being killed almost instantly by almost anything. You can't fight mobs. They will almost certainly kill you. I already had a skeleton run and fall through the roof in my base where my hole is for my the smoke to get out and I really had to break my way out in the corner over here to get out and get away I, I almost died doing that when I got in so this is definitely not an easy mod pack this is by far some of the, one of the hardest I wouldn't I mean some would say it's easy some would say it's hard but it's not conventional in any means uh, to normal Minecraft you can't just go up and punch a tree you have to actually make an axe first and then you get logs, and, you, and even then you can't turn the logs into uh, planks because you need to have a saw, which I do not have yet. And to get a saw, you need to make first a saw mold out of clay, and then you got to fire the saw mold in a pit kiln. You also got to make uh, a, uh, what is it? I forget what it's called, a clay um, vase, I think it is. Oh, shoot. Crap. Didn't want to do that. Uh, a jar of some sort. A ceramic jar. Uh, let's see. A uh, ceramic vessel. And you gotta put um, something like uh, copper in there. You gotta put it in a pit kiln. You gotta heat You gotta get that's something up the, the copper. Then you gotta take and pour it into a mold. And then you get what you need. The problem right now is I'm having troubles trying to get copper. So I, I know I'm throwing right into this thing but right now I am very low on copper and I've already had to make four of these vessels to store all my crap so right now I have six copper I need four more to be able to make a new uh, tool um sorry I was taking an inventory check and everything um yeah so, I've already put points on my map. I've already tried to go mining. I haven't been able to get anything. So, right here is my home. I'm using Journey Map, by the way, to help. So, my home is right here. Um, uh, Serpentine. Serpentine. I can't remember how. I don't know how to spell it. Lignite. Uh, copper. Bismethanite. Bismethanite. I don't know how. Bismethanite. <laughs> Whatever. La these are large ones. I got some copper deposits here somewhere underground. And I got a large copper deposit over here. I think somewhere in this area, somewhere, there is a cave which I might go into to look for ore. Because right now I'm not getting any um, progress just mining. So I think that's what I'm going to do for this episode. Uh, yeah. So let me just get some water. In my ceramic jar. Uh, I've also been growing quite a few crops. That's half done. Uh, just fill up my water. Eat a bit more venison. And then I'm good. Okay. And I'll just pause the video here and I'll be... I'll come back when I am at the cave. Okay, this is not the cave, um, uh, hold on, where's my face cam? 
Okay, so this is not the cave that I was talking about, but I may go down here. It looks like it's a bit of a dangerous drop and it's not going to be easy to get out, so... Yeah, I'm not going to take this cave. I want to keep going, but I'll keep that one in mind. Okay, I believe this is the cave here. Now, dynamic lighting is in this, but it causes a... It used to cause a bit of lag. I don't know if it still does. No, it doesn't, so... At least not as much like I'm dropping down to a few frames here. This cave looks like it's got nothing in it. Well, that's a bummer. Well, so I'm gonna have to find another cave. Here, we got some ore here. So this is appetite, and I'm not quite sure what this provides. Uh, what are you? Oh, that's just fertilizer. That's right. I know what this is from. That's... Okay, yeah. Appetite is from... I'm used to it being a bright silvery blue. Because that is from... Uh, factory... Reloaded? My factory reloaded? Yeah. Swimming against the current here. Uh, it's, it looks like it's actually getting dark. I should probably run back. And I'll just gonna cut the video till um, then. So it's day and I'm back here, so I'll see you guys then. Actually, another thing, guys, I didn't want to point out. Uh, if you notice, I'm wearing a different headset. And there might be a bit of background fuzz. That's because this headset tends to pick up, uh, gets a bit of a, in, uh, how do I explain this? My computer doesn't have a, a two-in-one um, microphone and um, headphone adapter. It has a split. So I have to have one for my, so I have one uh, plug for my, Headphone and one plug for a jack for my headphone and a jack for my microphone, but it's not a jack headphone uh, dual adapter. So, or in one. So I have to use an, uh, an adapter which came with uh, an older one of my headphones. But when I have it plugged in, it causes a bit of a fuzzy background. So. I also have another mod installed that makes it incredibly dark at night. And or when I mean by dark, I mean it's just super dark. So this appetite is no use to me, really. I like that we have Mechanism. That's a mod that I know fairly well. I just not in, uh... Just, I don't know it very well when it comes to Terra Firma craft. Um, yeah. So ore is going to be bit, is a very big... Uh, problem. I'm just gonna hope that I'll be able to get some ore because I got a waypoint way out here for where there's a large copper deposit. I tried mining in this area, I couldn't find anything, which is was was very concerning for me. I'm not used to mining, and I went pretty deep, and uh, I found a level where I would think I would I'm gonna find what I'm looking for, but I just couldn't find it. So, I'm thinking I'm going to head over to the copper area because that part is much lower to the ground, I believe. I could be wrong. Um, what is your coordinates? Yeah, it's 145. That's still pretty high. But then again, this world is very high. So, um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the morning. Now, this is something I didn't know I could do. Can I really cook this? Hold on, what does this make? It's high. It doesn't look like it's actually cooking. Oh, the carrot is now a light color, medium, dark. Okay, it's very hot now. I cool you down. Cook carrot dark. Oh, that actually gives me quite a lot of nutrients. I should be cooking my vegetables. <laughs> a cooked carrot. That is pretty nice. Hey, of course you can cook carrots. Why did I think that? Why did I think you couldn't? I've had steamed carrots before. But I think I've had fried carrot before. As weird as that may sound. Still night. Oh. Recording cut out already? Jeez, I've already been recording for more than 10 minutes. That's surprising. Anyway pretty dark out. I really want to just head out and start, uh, just, jeez, something got dark again. I think the last of the torches are just going out.
Or no, this just went out. I need some more permanent lighting. Yeah, I'm gonna be stuck with filters for a while. Would you look at that? My um, soybeans have matured now. Oops, I, I meant to fill that up with water. Jeez, what am I doing? Whoa, I'm getting a huge amount of legs suddenly. Uh, hold on. Uh, let's see, where's my axe? Oh, I'll pick up the freaking... Okay, I'm getting a bit of a leg. A bit of leg here. Uh, I don't know what's going on. Why are you suddenly... Yeah, I guess it isn't leg. It's just... Didn't know. Okay, I guess I'm not paying attention then. It's not leg. I'm just not paying attention. Okay, these ones are almost grown. Uh, that's a bit more soybean. Let's see. Uh, still summer. I need to increase my grain, fruit, and dairy intake. Ooh. How am I going to get something with dairy? I don't know where I'm going to find dairy. I, I can probably start um, fixing my grain intake in a bit. I think this counts as grain, too. This corn, it's meza ear, which I believe is just corn. I believe that's a grain, so yeah. I'm gonna head over to actually to the copper area and see if I can get some ore or some just copper lying on the ground or if, I'm, if I can just mine into the place stuff. Yeah, you get what I'm talking about. Be there in a bit. Okay, I'm over in the area where I found some ore, some copper on the ground as well as my prospector pick that broke a little while ago. Uh, found. If you guys know that, if you're wondering how I know where these resources are, because I had prospector pick, it's just broke because I use it so much. <laughs> But before it broke, I was able to find those. So I'm just going to... Ah, here. More copper. So I'm just going to run around and see if I'm finding copper ore on the ground. Uh, so there's there's two types of copper ore, I believe. There's malachite and there's just native copper ore. I've found two malachite in the past. I guess I used them, which I don't remember too much. I, mu I must have because I can't seem to find them anymore. Oh, what? Well, I think I found my copper ore. That's interesting. Um, I'm going to head down here and mine this up. This has got to be copper ore, isn't it? It is. It's native copper. Yes, that right there is one tool. Because it takes 100 units to make a tool each. So, this is perfect. I'm so glad I found this native copper ore. Well, that solves that issue I was having. Whoa, uh, texture glitch much? So I'm just gonna mine all this out. It's kinda nice. Uh, am I getting frame leg or block leg? So much copper here. Oh, yep, it was a bit of lag there. I think the particles of the copper were kind of moving to the side when I was mining that one. I think it was the wind. Yeah, cool how the particles move with the wind in this game. Uh, so what's the frame drops all of a sudden? It was going fine a second. Oh, hold on. I don't know what's with the frame issue, frame rate issues, but I'm just going to continue to record this. It isn't that bad. Ugh. It could be better, but... I'm used to it. <laughs> Probably some of my viewers don't like it that much, but I'm going to continue to record because I really want to make a series out of this. So, this is good. Copper is good. Um, uh, having access to so much copper will, is really going to help me in the long run. Did I mention it was good? Uh, let's see. So, how much native copper do I have now? 1620. I think that's more than enough. That's going to make me at least 10 tools. And I don't even need to make that much. So, yeah. Good. Okay, so next, uh, the next one I need to make is a saw. I'll be back in a bit. Interesting. In my attempt to chop down this tree, it has broken my axe, but it's also killed the trees in the nearby vicinity. So... I'm just going to chop, continue to chop this thing down until I can get all the wood I can. 
Uh, I'm gonna need to find a stick up right there. No, not that. Jeez. This takes forever to chop, I swear. <sighs> there. That's a lot of wood. That's more than enough wood. That's been lasting a while, so that's good. I'm always going to need some wood. So I'm just going to head back home, and I'll see you guys then. Okay, I'm home. Let's start putting, I want to start putting these actually in stacks outside. So if you shift right click with a log, you can start making log piles like this. Put one there. Come on. Don't lag. There, I got some wood piles. I'm going to need those later for uh, some other things, but first... Okay. Let me get a ceramic jar. So, if I want to make... So, I have two more molds, so I'll just make two more tools for now. I'm going to need to make... That's one tool. That's two tools, so that's, more, so that's just enough. So I take that, put some straw in there. Need eight logs. Jeez. Oh, when the frame drops, and then I need to get a fire starter. I'm gonna have to plug in more sticks. This is doing one. Oh, there we go. There. I'm gonna eat some of my cooked carrot. And that's why I got the hole in the roof there to let some of the smoke out. It doesn't all come out. <laughs> uh, I don't see a whole lot here because I think I got my particles down. Okay, it is nighttime now. Oh, and it's raining. Would you look at that? By the way, there was a uh, tornado that or that was that didn't really touch down, but it went right over me. Freaking scary. Let's see. No mobs out over here. Don't know why I can see. I shouldn't be able to see. What are my video settings? Smooth lighting levels. Um. Hmm. Don't know how to turn down the brightness. It should be very dark. It should be like way darker than this. You guys probably can't see. Depends on the video brightness. For you guys. Um, this rye is almost done. Boy, it's dark out. Okay, so what do I got here? I got this parasol mushroom. Macro lo <laughs> Macro le piota procara. Procara. I do not know how to s read or thank you recording system for being only 10 minutes. That is a wonderful. I really got to be so poor. <laughs> there. <coughs> Ugh. Okay, so, uh, uh, let's see. Organized inventory. Let's put all these soybeans together. Oh, jeez. Oh, shoot, I didn't want to do that. Crap. Oh, jeez. Okay, yeah, these have all decayed a lot. Can I, uh, scrape off... Yeah, if I do this, 
I get rid of the decay and I'll lose some of the food, but it gets rid of the decay on there. That. Can I put like a mushroom on there? No, I can't. Uh, what flavor does it have? It's got no flavor. I need to find a way to like add some like flavoring or salt or some spices. Ooh, this is done. Okay, so this is how I make my tools. So I got these two uh, here. So I take the ceramic vessel, and I take the uh, mold I want, and I put it in there, and it fills up the mold. It's 100 units per tool, usually. Uh, I usually, I tend to usually lose the mold. Yeah, I always lose the mold. But now, I can, I need more sticks. Hold on. Do I have a torch? Yeah. Gotta be careful out here. Don't want to run into a mob. Where are sticks when you need them? Huh. Huh, a piece of gold here I didn't catch. Huh. Come on, pick it up. Gee. Okay, I got sticks now, and it's about to become day. So I now have a copper axe and a copper saw. Yes! And I got an achievement. I believe quest book. Casting age. Open. Yes. Thank you. Okay, so now that I can do that, I can now make myself some chests. So if I take um, some logs, I do this, I believe. I can get like, so it's half the usual Minecraft stack is the most I can hold. Okay. Okay, let's see. So this is, uh, that's a plank. I believe I have four of them. I can make a crafting table, as usual. And when I crafting table, it now is in my inventory now. My workbench is here. So I take a bunch of these, I can now make chests, and I believe you can make indeed double chests. You can't put your tools up, which is okay, but I can put all my other junk in there. I'm going to have to start organizing everything. I can put hammers in there, which is interesting. I don't know why I can put hammers in there, but not other things. Take that out. I want my carrots and soybean. Um, I can't organize it. But anyway, uh, let's see. So that's axe there, saw there, pickaxe here. Uh, pick do, do, do. Okay, so if I want to make, uh, racks for tools. If I do this, and this, yeah, I can make tool rack. i put this up here. Put all my tools. There. Okay, so I got more planks. Now, if I take, now, if I want to make some, uh, if I'm correct, do this, uh, hold on, how do I make, uh, support beams, uh, hold on, is it like this?
this how you do it? Uh, hold on. That's how you do it. You gotta, like, do it in this exact pattern. Otherwise, it doesn't work. So, this is support beams. This is what I'm gonna need for mining. Which is kind of cool. Okay, so, um, no another thing I need to start working towards. Um... A sword. I should make a sword. So, I'm gonna make that out of clay. I'm gonna make the mold out of clay. Okay, so... No, hold on. A uh, sword mold. Yes. There. Okay, so that's the sword mold. Now, I can make one mold. However, I might want to make more molds. So, what do I not have that I can make? So, let me actually just type mold. Uh, chisel. Well, I, you know what? I should make um, a hammer mold and a chisel mold. So, that's easy. Hammer. That's also easy. Um, mace. Uh, should I, I should make just a, that's a javelin head. Make a shovel mold. Oh, there it is. It didn't give it to me for some reason at first. So I put these all in here. that in my inventory okay so uh, let's see take more of the straw so that's four molds I'm also going to need to take a ceramic jar and then put some copper in it so four molds that's that makes two right there that makes uh, Four, so that's eight. So if I take eight native copper, put it in there. That's fifty units. So fifty times five times eight is forty. So I put the extra zero because of the fifty. So yeah. So that should be good. I'm gonna need one more straw. Hold on. Uh, another thing, I can actually make a knife mold if I want to. I want to make a knife mold. I'll just add some more uh, knife mold. Yeah. Oops. Just get rid of that, but yeah, whatever. Okay, so if I clay knife mold, if I take this and add two more in there, that's enough for the extra, the next mold. Now we need sixteen more logs, eight for each. It's four. Oh, sixteen. I'm gonna probably need to make another fire starter. Oh, don't lay on me. Ah! Ugh. Have I really been recording for that long? Jeez. Okay, fire starter. I'm gonna need to make another one. Because if this, this is only gonna light one, if it does. No. Whoops. Yep. Come on, start with the fire. Start it. There. It's gonna create a bit of smoke. Come on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ow. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay, I got the sticks. Um. Ow. <laughs> Don't want to do that. I shouldn't do that. <laughs> Careful. There. Just give me the steak. Let me eat it. I keep going to hit shift and it just throws it into my uh, crafting table. I don't know how many times I've actually wanted to do that, but it doesn't actually do that. So. Uh, 
Um, water. And that's about it. So I'm going to let those uh, finish up. And I'm just going to end the video here because I've been recording for quite a while. And I need to edit. So I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. If you do subscribe, uh, make sure you hit the bell because YouTube is weird. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.